time to exercise our creativity. Just like you exercise your bodies and your brain to make yourself smart, we need to exercise like artists. You're gonna get a piece of paper with a squiggle or a drawing on it. It's our job to turn it into something new. So let's think, what can I turn this squiggle into? I could turn it into a mushroom and then add more mushrooms around it. Or it could be a penguin. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go with my mushroom idea. So I'm gonna grab a crayon or whatever it is you have at your desk or table and bring our idea to life. So I'm gonna continue this line and make my shape into a mushroom and bring my idea to life but I'm not done. I want to fill my page. I think I'm gonna add more mushrooms in here and create like a forest floor. Now that I have my mushrooms drawn, I'm gonna keep adding some details. Make them look more like mushrooms. There's a little cap, adding the underneath, bringing my idea to life. Now, I'm still not done. I wanna fill in my entire space. So I'm gonna add some grass to my forest floor. maybe a few flowers, a tree. Remember, whatever it is that you're drawing, we're exercising our creativity. We wanna use our entire page. Think like an artist. Okay. So now I have my drawing done, but I'm not done yet. I wanna make sure that I add color to my drawing, be the best artist that I can be. So I'm gonna add in some red to my mushrooms, green to my grass, and really fill my page all the way. I'm gonna speed this up and show you what this looks like at the end. So here is my completed creativity exercise. I filled my whole page, added tons of color. The question is, what can you create? The possibilities are endless. Make sure to fill your page, use color, take your time, and most of all, have fun.